Welcome back to Awesome Possum Hobbies and Games. This is Chris Fossum, and I'm back with another arena video. Today we are going to be playing Sealed's Wilds of Eldraine. Let's get cracking those packs, see what we can get, see if the deck will be any good, and do some games. Why, yes, I do want to use one of my seal tokens I've been holding for a long time. So we got Sneak Attack. I love that card. Michael's Prank. Very good. Looks like uh, black and blue are some, have some fantastic cards. Michael's Prank. Two black, two colorless sorcery. Choose one or more. I love those choose cards. Lord's Skitter's Blessing. Looks good. Let's go. Blessing enters the battlefield. Create a wicked roll attached to a target creature you control at the beginning of your draw step. If you control an enchanted creature, you lose one life and draw an additional card. Wow. Card advantage is huge. And the Fawn's Bane Troll, which. Man, I love this card. If you know me, I love my black and green. 4 4 for a black, a green, and two colorless. This creature troll. When Fawn's Bane Troll enters the battlefield, Create a monster roll token attached to it. Sacrifice an aura attached to Fawn's Bay Troll. Fawn's Bay Troll fights target creature you don't control. If that creature would die this turn, exile instead. Activate only as a sorcery. Working with rank, uh, working with the Lord Skills Wrestling, and there's so many, so many other cards. Let's see what we get for the rest of them. I'm gonna go ahead and look at black because we know black is some hotness. That card's gonna go in immediately. Oh, stab wound. Card's fantastic. Make things smaller. Shatter the Oath. Wrinkles Prank. Um, Handy Grapple. That card was an MVP for me at the pre release. Uh, Lord Skitter's Butcher, which allows you to do so many things. Uh, if I negotiator. It's just going to be a 3-5 most times. And there's a battlefield destroy target creature. Opponent controls and dealt damage this turn. Well, we'll take a look at that a little bit later. There's a battlefield create a food. Sacrifice. Uh, you're mostly looking at it as a 3-2 three, for 3. Uh, Roman Scrum Church. Spell, spell is a bargain. Look at the top four cards at the library. Otherwise, you just draw two cards and lose two life. Four five death touch deals combat damage to create a food token. Oh, card's incredible! And another black green card. So let's go ahead and throw those in and see what kind of green cards we got. Green, search your library for a card. You get to put uh, a land and put it in your hand. Card to cool. Let's look at the creatures. Troublemaker, Oof. guys, a keeper. There's a battlefield. If you control a creature with a power four greater, you get to draw a card, which will replace itself. And then whenever a creature with power four greater enters a battlefield under your control, you get to draw another card. It's really good. Let's look at those uh, Utopia's Crawl. Or hurry the deck up a little bit. Beast Sock Worm. Uh, five, four, four, or for five. A little expensive, but let's see what we can do. Create food. Get to whenever an aura enters play, get to draw a card. Card's great. It's good. Man, we're gonna be short. Look at the black in addition. May have to throw some extra cards in there. Let's look at that blue cards. If there was as for told. Oh, that card's incredible. Not not fantastic in this format, but it's a good card. Blue is just. It's alright. Uh, looking. Looking Breach. Turn target creature you don't control. Man. Blue does some, have some nice cards. It's like the beginning of those. It's got a wide variety of cards. Not much having to do with enchantments, though. That's the direction I really want to go. So let's just stick with black, green, 
if there's any colorless cards. Bingo. <coughs> Got some fixing cards. Maybe we can we can splash another car color. So big. Let's just go big go home. 39. And there's a battlefield create food. Foods you control have have to add. Where's the rest of this food? Creates food. I guess we can sacrifice food tokens. We're going to be cutting some cards, don't worry. Okay, so we're 45. Let's go ahead and go to the biggest things and start shrinking the deck. Got one of those. Wild ambush. ambush. I love that. Card's amazing. You feel just crawl speed the deck up. Removal. Uh, card draw. Sweet tooth, good card. We're gonna keep that in because it creates food. Creates food and it's a land. Six six trample. Let's keep one in. Yeah, I cut three cards. I like one forty one. Troublemaker oof is amazing. Go ahead and cut him right now. Blessing Uprising is so good, especially because you got it says four or more. It's through five flying is good, but it's two base. It's kind of rough. Well, I'm gonna try with 42. 42 is not necessarily where you want to be, but it's where I'm gonna start with. So let's start playing. If there's something you would probably would have played instead. Listen in the comments below. Let me know. I need to learn the, the hard way or I'm learn the easy way from you. While we're waiting, Let's see if the uh, shuffler works today. Did not draw a green land, but the evolving wild will help me get the green land. And it's actually pretty solid. I'll keep it. Lots of card draw, some good removal. I'm going first. Go get this forest. Just wait on my opponent. That's kind of fun. Go get that forest. I'm not going to wait till the end of my opponent's turn. Let's waste everybody's time. Not gonna bargain. Just go get the forest. Be done. Hmm. Probably just a land. Wow. They actually could do it. I want to play one of my favorite creatures in the set. Or enters the battlefield under my control. Draw a card. 
card draw is what it's all about in this format. I love the fact that Wizards adds extra detail to the backgrounds. It makes it feel fun. Last casket. No. Now I wish I played it. Oof. And I'm just gonna have to, uh, I'm gonna have to sit on a turn, passing all around. Drew most of my non-creature spells this game. This could be a rough one. That's a good one. We're fine, Death Touch. Pretty strong. Let's see how he kills him. Now he can play his 5 4 reach. There's the removal I was talking about. Hit me for three. Mm. We'll go ahead. Make that guy a little bit smaller, easier to deal with. I'm done. Good. It's gonna hit me for three. Let's see if I can summon some creatures here. That's what I'm talking about. I get my five four reach first. Should have maybe one or two removal. One more, one more removal left in his hand. Time is running out for my opponent. Here he comes. Because he probably has something to be able to pump his stuff. I'll just take the damage. I know I can defend my next turn. Ooh, he got his biggie in play. Wish I had one more land. Two damage every turn. It's pretty good. Let's see if this is game, though. That glass cat. Cats get hurt bad. Ooh, that's a good one. Wait a turn. I'm just gonna try to push. 
Here he comes. Has some blockers. Gotta block his big boy. I'll make mine just a little bit bigger. Duck down a little bit, grab a land. This could be too little, too late. Yeah. Let's go on to game two. Reach for four. That's expensive. Five or greater. Which I've only got three spells in there. Let's go ahead and cut that out. I love the apple. Really looking forward to sacrificing it for one of my bargain cards. Let's go. Did you, any of y'all get a chance to play this yet? I love Sealed Deck. Sealed Deck's my favorite. The uh, upcoming Magic Con in Las Vegas. Sealed is what the $100,000 cash purse tournament is going to be based on. At least the first round. Yikes. No land. Well, two swaps. But that's not going to do it. I'm going to have to... My opponent goes first. I'm going to have to mulligan. And... That doesn't look any better. I have to keep it. Let's go land. Man, this is rough. Other cards are better. At least I'm going second. Man. Draw land, so I can take advantage of that. Beats. And he did draw. I did draw land. That's great. Didn't help me too much. Let's see what I can draw next turn. If I draw a land next turn, it helps a lot. Right up, the Sweet Tooth Scourge is just so good. More summon beats for two. Takes me to 17. My opponent miss her land drop. What is your scrying? Oh, there it is. Just waiting a little bit. Free life, like, hey, there's a land. We got flyers. What am I doing against flyers? That's just too far away. Let's go ahead and search. And let's create the food. I know I can do something with the food later on. Get that green. I'm sure my opponent's like, what in the world is it doing? Wow. 
one three flying lifelink. And they're scrying. That's so that's such a good good process. Just gotta keep that because I'm sure it's removable. And when it rains, it pours. Lots of land. Let's see if there's a counter. Only one blue. There's only one kind of counter he can have. No essence capture. And uh, we're gonna have to pull the trigger on that. Just to beat on him. Maybe for one, flying. That is what I like. Mm, he's all tapped. He has all of his mana available. Let's go ahead and make it less attractive for him. Let's go ahead and do first contact. Second main phase. I got six mana. I'll try to skim the summon the uh, counter with the smaller creature. I'll get my food. And I'll be done. My board stays pretty good right now. Sword Tiger Creature with mana value three or less. Let's go ahead and sacrifice the food. There's a life. Draw a card. four cards off of someone's deck is pretty good in this environment. And he has a big nasty. That's not just a 3-3. Three, three. One, two. He's only got one creature. Hit me for one's not a lot. And I'll go ahead and get in there. Four. Boom. He's just gonna look at that thing. What am I gonna do against it? Yeah, he's gonna let it play. Be in play. And um, yeah, I'm done. Let's 
Let's keep his mana available for some, for some reason. Must have a counter of some sort. Just waiting for me to play that. Big rat. He's gonna make a token. There's the big beats. Yeah. Uh, unfortunate for him, he's all tapped out. I'm just gonna give him a Mr. Mystery. Before it has a chance to get bigger. Didn't attack. It's all tapped out. I'll go ahead and um thing stock worm and play. And uh summon attackers. Can't block with the one one token. But he'll go ahead and block with his flare now. Take four. And I'll get my mighty mighty food token. That wrinkles prank is starting to look really attractive to be able to play soon. Hmm. Especially with that. we go. I'll start making things a bit crazy. We'll chop block. Chop block with the high thing. Negotiate. No, it's not going to. He's got to be able to kill me, and he doesn't have it, so he'll concede. Good game, man. Good game. On to game three. So... Now we're up to 400 gems in three packs. That's all right. He has to get the five. 1,600 gems in three packs. Here you go. Pay for pay for your play. Anything higher than that, you're really making money. I feel like it, the, the odds of doing that aren't great, even if you're incredibly good. got a good number of great cards in my hand, so we'll keep it. Summon 2-2. Two -two. Negative. Play, play an extra land, so... Get ahead of the curve. That uprising to play next turn. Have to do some work. Gotta take it slow. Gurk's uprising. When Gurk uprising enters the battlefield, if you control a creature with four, power four or greater, draw a card. Creatures you control have trample. Whenever a creature with power four or greater enters the battlefield under your control, you get to draw a card. Yeah, so I'm gonna be playing from here on out. I go. Hmm. There's a lot of choices here. I think the best way to go is 
not drawing a land last turn. That turn hurts. But let's go ahead and uh, make a run of this for him. And I'm gonna discard some cards. Everyone's got to discard, discard some cards, though. And uh, each player sacrifices two creatures. Let's get on the advantage of that. people play that card. I'm not impressed. I don't think it deserves a slot. Let's go ahead and get this card advantage going. There's that land. And we'll go ahead and uh, let's creature in. So we get some advantage going. See what he does. He's got the crown of winter in play, which will tap down my 4 4. Well, I guess he's not going to bother. And let's get that attack. those food tokens going. An option to be able to fight. Yeah, let's go ahead and fight. Yeah, I won't be able to draw from the Lord Skitter's Blessing, but killing his creatures when he only has one card in hand. Bench. Ooh, a pump creature. Deck down. Let's get another food token in play. He's gonna tap down the, the troll. Let's get in there for three. Let's see if he chop blocks. So I can get another food token. I know it doesn't seem like food tokens are that big of a deal in this. Now I'm just losing a creature. But right now I'm playing for card advantage. And if I can get more tokens in play, they allow me to activate other abilities. So I have two current. Oh, two enchantments. He, since he has none, that's good. Let's go to my turn. Um, let's get in there for four. If he decides to block, which he does, let's ambush him. Boom. And then let's buy him from adventure and draw a card. And play a land. That should be game. Unless he drew a creature. Oh, Sir Ginger. I'm sorry. You're not going to be able to do much. Get in there. The game sat down. That was good game three. Deck did what it was supposed to. I uh, probably played a little bit too aggressive. But that's all right. We're going to go on to uh, game three. Two wins. Up to 600 jumps, three packs. Remember, that key is. Five or six or more, uh, five or more wins to make it worthwhile. Let's see how we can do. But it's time for uh, this deck to not draw well, according to uh, what everyone usually says about the shuffler.
But you never know until you play the game. Got my three land, got Utop Utopia Stroll, got a Bean Software Worm. You, you know, I think this is a keeper. Choose black. One one menace. That's weird. Let's get that land in play. So next turn I'm playing five drops on turn three. Not too shabby. But Tabby, pretty darn good. Drop. Let's go ahead and get the five drop that he no. Let's get that in place. Not taking any chances. Rather get that card advantage going. I can take three, two, four. An interesting card. This card's got to go in red. I don't know if it's an improvement to the red deck wins, but it is a phenomenal card, especially if you're able to get two or three counters on it. There's my two damage, like I knew about. See what he does for his three drop. I'll just play a big creature. Draw a card. Next turn will be very saucy if I could draw a forest. I'm gonna take none. No, I'll take five. You wanna talk about it? I'm not gonna block that. Oh wait, turn. Up to three counters. He's got three cards in his hand, so oh. better just build. He's looking at my card, thinking about it. Is he gonna activate the ability? No idea. You went for more greed. Sacrifice this creature. Didn't realize there was gonna, gonna get a bunch of land to play. Okay, well, I really need to deal with that. If I just buy him the big style. Oh, it costs seven, okay. Unless I want to sacrifice an artifact or an enchantment. Uh, the sprawl has done a lot of work. Let's go ahead and bargain. Buy sprawl. It's nice you knowing you. See if I could draw that land I wanted. Oh. Yes, Arena really wants me to uh, be done. He's gonna give his thing a uh, death punch. This little tabby, tabby cat. Some death touch. Boom. Creature dies. Play my land. I'm alright. Still winning. It's got card advantage. I got more land in play. But he did take advantage of exiling all those 
too bad I didn't take advantage of getting to play one of those hands. Looking at his spells. He's got a black spell he's gonna cast. With my glutton. Not as much fun. He doesn't have enough for a bargain. He's like, you wanna take six? Yeah, I'll take six. Or take four. Because unless he does something, I wanna beat him upside the head for six. With my Hamlet gl glutton. Big giants are good. Seven. Trample. Trample's big. Danger, Will Robinson. If you play a creature, that could be game. Thanks to the tempting apple. That card. I'm not playing red, but I'm gonna take your card for take your creature to win to turn and do a little beating. Oh. Looks like he's given up. Yeah. Cause uh, I'm sorry, buddy. That's game. That's a lot of damage. Good game, Lars. Let's go on to game four. We're about 42 minutes into this game session. And we played um, four games, up 3-1, which is good. Getting close to that five wins mark, which I'm a big fan of. Let's go ahead and start her up. Hope I can get this done in uh, an hour. Three wins, two losses. Five more games would be a lot of time. We'll see what we can do. Evolving Wilds. Troll. Man, it's a lot of expensive stuff. Go for more greed. Going first. Get that swampage. Because you don't have to. Let's keep the theme going. Bend the deck down. Give me my swamp. Call it good. Red player doesn't drop that first one drop. Hey, hey, 2 2. What does this guy do? We gave your combat. In turn, if you control a creature with power 4 or greater, you may discard a card if you do draw a card. Wow, that's. A 2 2 for 2? Pretty much. I take it. Boom. Probably should have played before he attacked. Beggars can't be choosers. Let's go ahead and uh, at least have control do something next turn. I'm only gonna take three, four, five, whatever. Man. Pretty good play. Grabby Giant to create treasure tokens at the end of your opponent's turn is really good. Especially because if you get a 4 3, you discard a card to draw a card. Get rid of that pesky land. So 12. Head. Mm. 
Yeah. Five five. He's playing black. He might be able to kill it next turn. Let's go ahead and just get advantage on it. If he's still around, the Lord Scooter's blessing will allow me to. Somewhat of an advantage. Is it gonna hit me four? Maybe more. Let's find out. It's that grabby giant. I don't. I'm not gonna touch it. Yep. No blacks. I like taking damage. Makes me feel alive. <laughs> that was so cool. That's, this is good. Is that to play? Hmm. Get a four or five and play. It's a good blocker. I'm in danger zone, so I gotta sit back and relax a little bit. My troll's still in play at the beginning of my draw phase. I would draw an extra card and lose a life. That is gonna could be dangerous. Five. Yeah, five mana. Save him for that six, that treasure token. He's sitting there like, look at that. Like, what am I going to do? And he's thinking about that. He's like, did I save it? Or should I play it now when I have a, have a chance? These things are going to start getting out of control for him. Not the way I wanted to do my first bit of damage. Attacks. Menace is hurting me. Playing top deck, he's got five land, he's got that six mana. That is that bargain. He's looking at targets. What's he gonna do? Oh, bomb and troll, I'm a big fan. See if he uh, misplays it. Best thing you do is just hold on to it, not sack it. Turn. Fortunately for him, with bargain, targeting that. Sacrificing my food. <laughs> that food sacrificing is it's hard because that's my mana. My life. Uh, combat. I don't really do much. Probably should throw the monstrosity at him. Minstrosity. Since both his creatures have three toughness. But he'll be able to get in for three now. So I decided to try to progress the game. I 
Got that token in play. Tokens are so good in this set. They can do so many different things. Six mana plus a token. Can't take bolt. Well, gonna have to let that resolve. Now, is it gonna hit me for three? Pass to attackers. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to gain three life. Didn't really want to. Or if I had to. Put me back to five. There's that four or three. It's a good game. Let's go ahead and pay full cost. Three extra life right there. And I can't attack this turn. I gotta save blockers. Build this board. Smart play. If I draw a land next turn, I'd be in deep trouble. Can't attack. Got one more creature to play. Fortunately, he has no trample. That, that menace, though, is rough. He's got more cards in hand. Twisted Sewer Witch. Uh, what did I do? There's Battlefield. Wicked. That's that should be game right there. Yeah, should be game. Yeah, numbers me significantly. Plays this token forest. Looks at my stuff. Ah, <laughs> good game, y'all. Good game. Two losses. Sitting at three and two. Let's see. Let's see if we can make this game worthwhile or if it, this draft was just mediocre. It's a good hand. Let's get that black mana going. Extra land this turn. Oh. No, I won't. I made a mistake. I'll play a 3-1. Uh, a because I apparently got ahead of myself. Could lose me the game. We'll see. Yeah, that would have been nice. Monstrosity. It was in for three. Let's get in there. Put the easy three. Or he decides to block. And uh, I like my mistrust a little bit too much. Let's go wide a little bit. Draw land next turn, it'll be really good. I got two five drops. Not a big deal with the stab wound, which I'd rather not play. Ooh! He's gonna be tapping out the monstrosity because he's afraid. That's not a horrible draw. I want creatures now get trampled. 
in reaction, he'll pipe down the minstrosity. Fear the trample rat that can't block. Yeah, for three. Decided to destroy my toy. That is going to be tapped down again. Is there nothing on the side? Flicking a coin, giving me food. I'm all about the food. That's why I'm all about the food. Not drawing that fifth land, though. Shuffler's starting to hurt me. Moss loves that card. Here's one of his favorite. Goes against his token island. <laughs> Guessing it's my turn. It's still not a creature. Alright, it's a creature. It's still not land. Tapping down. The butcher. Get in there for one. Plan look out. Hope, hoping I draw something. Uh, let's we draw a card. Get to that fifth land. Two two. Four four. This be a shame if I uh, stabby stabby it. Well, it's not the land I was looking for. That's the land I deserve. Got a forest. Gonna tap down my skitter. Skitter's butcher. Let's see if I can get in there for two. Boom. Wish I'd drawn one of those for this deck. This guy is incredibly good. A feeling that uh there you go gain your three make you feel better gain your life always feels better two three flyer Good. I think I'll have to kill it next turn. Especially since they only have one card in hand. That's so five to put back in hand. They're not doing it. I'll wait till end of turn, I guess. Or Scooter's Blessing. It's my jam, yo.
draw some cards. Because we all like it when we draw cards, right? That's what this game's all about. Just my S3 S3. Let's see what he does. Tapping down my big guy. Nope. Guys. Nice. Let's go ahead and get the rats in there. Snip, snip, snip. Bitey, bitey, bitey. It's food. My opponent's in trouble. My four color deck. She's doing romp. Back to hand. He doesn't have enough mana to be able to do it again, though. My turn. How oh, I take a damage. Sorcery. So I tap down my three four. Get in there with two three. He'll block. And let's go ahead and start casting uh, four or five. Death touch. Put us on the on the draw. Let's see if you can draw two cards. Of those three, Oops. land. He's got the screen puff. Fortunately for me, I'll be able to kill it. He's gonna make it big. If I got land. Well, let's just kill it. Wicked screen puff. And that's game. Four victory, four wins. Two losses. My magic number of five is right around the corner. Let's see if we can get it done. to game seven. It's a lot of games in this. Hope y'all are enjoying this. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm enjoying this set. It's, I'm seeing a surprising number of comments of how horrible this set is. And I, I have to say that I'm having a blast with it. This has been a lot of fun. Um, there's Lots of fun cards to be able to play. So black. Lots of fun cards to be able to play in the set. Lots of ways of doing things. It's it's stuff that you don't see all the time, and it I think it personally it, it works well. The synergies are fantastic. I don't know how it looks in other environments yet, but I have to say that it's. Uh, been fun for me. Let's go ahead and get that swappage. Clint's probably going to play uh, a creature. 
Oversold Cemetery. Wow. That is incredible. That's that's going to be huge against me. Didn't even know that was uh, in that in the set for one of the flashback cards. Two, three, four, five. Huh? Get a death touch for going. Beat his oversold cemetery. But he's got removal spells up the wazoo, I'm sure. If not. Three, four. Boil. It's good. Draw my land. Make mine wicked. And just because that card is so good. I'm feeling a little stabby. I'll pay the extra mana. See if I can slow him down a turn. And now he doesn't have enough to be able to kill my uh, cream puff by attack. Let's get in there while I have a chance. Not dead after all. Great card. I don't know why he didn't just bother to do the uh, Oversold Cemetery though. Can you play? Drew a card. It's pretty good. It's really good. Well. Ooh. That yeah, card's good in this format. It's gonna hit me for six. I'll end up taking seven for the turn. He's counting, doing something. Look at all those cards he's got too. He's got five, six. Mmm, that's strong. So I got seven mana. This guy just happens to cost seven. Okay, three. Get in there. Create food. Creating food is just gonna give me the edge. I've, I have a feeling, especially with the candy grapple in my hand and needing a uh, sacrifice ammo that's not my Utopia Sprawl. Hmm. That is a much bigger creature. Direct damage. And, uh, yeah. Let's see if he wants to uh, jump block with the 6 7. It's not really a jump block at that point. The trade. There he goes. And um, yeah, I'll trade. We both have one. We have four more creature cards in the graveyard now. Oh. Like that. Your turn. Ooh, that's a great card. I wish I had to get that in my pool. Four three trample. Is he gonna go after it? Nope. Sit on my cards. Oh, waste of turn. No attacks. I'm in trouble. I'm in big trouble. Big trouble, little China. One of the greatest movies ever. Express old people who remember the 80s. Five, five. Waste of 
create some food. Thank a rat. This turn, is it gonna get some? No. Jump block. Gotta draw one of my biggies, otherwise I'm in trouble. I am in trouble. But, uh, not one way you're about it, I'm in deep trouble. I think I'm gonna be dead in this turn. Maybe not this turn, maybe two turns. I got food and candy grapple, some blockers. He's thinking about it. We both get a food token. That's night life for me though, just sitting there. Mmm. It's really good. Replacing itself. So good. Let's gonna attack at the seven seven. And then I'm gonna have to uh block. Summon Candy Grapple. Let's see if mine's big enough. Let's see if he's got any awesome spells to save it. Doesn't look like it. Two creatures over Soul Cemetery. Another wasted turn. Not gonna cast. Not gonna use the uh, food yet. Got tricks up my sleeve. Boy, do I need to draw some creatures or removal or something. Something would be good. Card draw would be amazing. Wicked. That's wicked, baby. We got a pretty good draw. Pretty good deck. The synergy there is amazing. We're gonna attack with everything. For nine damage, I've killed their five four. So that would be the optimal play. Put back in hand. Now their creatures a seven six. Trample, and they draw a card. So their deck is really good. Yeah, I'm gonna have the block. That's not what I wanted to see. Card draw. Card draw that would have worked if I had just taken the damage and liked it. They should have game here. They got five cards. I got none. Now they're just rubbing in my face. Six, seven. I'll go ahead and sacrifice the food this turn, like it makes a difference. Well, Amber Celestial, you play very good today. Your deck is incredible. Highly jealous of your pools. Attacks with everything. I'll be a throw. Sacrifice the food. There's a few cards you can draw that can prolong this game. I don't think there's anything I can draw that can win this game. That oversold cemetery being there, I'm in. I'm in deep trouble. Deep, deep trouble. Ooh, horrible trouble.
If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. And uh, also check us out on Patreon. Patreons make this channel. There he goes. Tackle with everything. Pass the blockers. Block one. Sacrifice my food. Your life. Ouch. I'm at three. I think it's going to be time to. Uh, see the rest of this game here uh, next turn unless I get something amazing miraculous and highly improbable hey there we go highly junk and that's gonna be game there's no way for me to be able to survive what would block a 5-5 five, five. I gain three I still take take eight Thank you for joining me for this uh, this fun experience. I hope you guys had fun watching it. Until next time, keep them rolling. And thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please take the time to like the video and subscribe if you'd like to stay updated. Have a great day and keep them rolling.